Hey, welcome back. My name is Nick and this is my experiment. How far can I progress learning the guitar by practicing as little as 20 minutes a day? This is month 11 and the last iteration was solely about Julio Salvador Sagreras as the method book that I'm still using had two pieces of him inside. And yeah, I learned these two pieces. Uh, we're talking about Lesion 75 and Lesion 70. Yes, it's not chronological, but um, the book has 75 first, and I think that 75 is easier than 70. All right, let's check out Lesion 75. The piece is fairly easy. Um, at the beginning of bar 7, it is a little bit tricky to only use your pinky and your ring finger um, because you have no support from your index or middle finger. It's It's like a little bit quirky for me. And then uh, bar eight has a progression of bass note and treble note, um, like five quarter notes. So it's the beginning of bar nine as well. And your your thumb, well, I played with the thumb, so maybe I'm doing it wrong. Well, actually, I'm doing it wrong, checking out the <laughs> checking out the sheet music. Um, I play all the bass notes with the thumb, so my thumb has to jump a lot. So I'm jumping from the D string to the G string to the E string to the G string to the A string. And that is like, there's a lot of movement and it took me a while to nail it. Um, apart from that, it's a beautiful little piece. Let's check it out. was Lesion 75. And coming up next is Lesion 70. Uh, and I really, I really like the vibe and the feel of this, uh, of this little piece. It's just a Lesion. It's just a, an exercise. It's not, re it's not even a song or a piece. It's just an exercise, I would say. Really liked it. Um, I think this one is particularly difficult because you play a bass melody you play a treble melody and you play you play sort of a rhythm section in the uh, on the offbeat um so uh, it was mind blowing for me you're playing three three things at once um wow yeah pretty difficult because it starts with a b7 and the b7 is a i would say one of those chords that break my fingers but um Apart from that, really nice little piece. Let's check it out. Lesion 70. So yeah, cool. These were the two pieces that I learned in the last iteration. Only two pieces. Well, I have to say these were difficult for me. I had to put a lot of effort into this and I'm still struggling. It's, it's, uh, my body gets tense when I play. I'm so, I'm, I'm concentrating, you know, and it, I know it's not good to get tense, but what can I do? <laughs> 
Um, yeah, for me, it's pretty difficult to play these little lessons, but um, I'm proud that I managed to tackle them. And uh, upcoming is the last iteration of my experiment. I have no idea what I'm going to do. I wanted to do something fun. So let's get away from learning new material from the method book. Just maybe learn a pop rock song that you like, whatever. Um, but I'm not yet sure what I'm about to do next iteration, I have to say. Um, there is one thing, there's one thing that I might want to try. Because I have this theory. You see, I think that I'm not a good guitarist. I think it takes me way too much effort to get to this point. So I think if you have got talent or more motivation or whatever, more skill, I don't know, you would maybe reach the point that I am at way earlier. Because maybe I just have a physical handicap. And uh, I was always like a little bit disappointed that I cannot pull off the Vulcan greeting. I can't do it. So I, ha I don't have the ability in neither hand to pull this off. What I'm talking about is this, this move over here. So you put your, your, your pinky and your ring finger together. Well, you know what I'm talking about, right? The, the Vulcan. I can't do it. And there are people that can basically just do it and then do this. So going back and forth from the Vulcan. Uh, I can't even, I can't do it. So I, I talk to people that play the guitar well, that are, let's say, famous people on Twitch that I follow or people that I know that play instruments well. So musicians, I would say because I wouldn't even consider myself a musician yet. Anyway, and all of them, all of the people I talked to could pull off the fucking Vulcan. So maybe I'm, my body is, isn't capable of becoming a good guitarist. I don't know. <laughs> and it's so fucking frustrating, I have to tell you guys, because every time I see a good musician, I just ask them, hey, can you pull off the Vulcan? And they just go, yes. And I'm like, <laughs> this may be bullshit, you know, this may be utter bullshit, but um, it's fun to, to empirically prove that I'm wrong, uh, that I'm right, and that, that this is not bullshit. So I was thinking about for the next iteration, as you can see, I can't do it. I can't do it, even if I do it very slowly. Let's let, I can maybe do this. Oh, it, it, it. <laughs> I can't do it. It's so frustrating. So maybe for the next iteration, I will not practice the guitar. Maybe I will just practice to move my fingers and see if I can learn to move my fingers independently, to see if I can learn to pull off the Vulcan and maybe even go from the Vulcan to, to that 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 thingy over here. How should we call that one? The W. From the Vulcan, the V to the W. All right. Maybe we should just call it the V and the W. <sighs> Do you think I can, I can learn that? Maybe I'm just handicapped. I don't know. Ah, <laughs> uh, so much pressure. I just want to enjoy myself. Bloody hell. I hope you are enjoying yourself, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.